Why are we all here today? Why are you here? Why did you get up early? Why did you raise all that money? Why did you come out today? We're all here for someone. We're all here to conquer cancer in our lifetime. Think about that person or those people that you're here for today. Woodbine Racetrack for the fifth annual Road Hockey to Conquer Cancer. It's a beautiful setting and we're having a great day, so can't beat that. The event is extremely well organized, entertaining and fun. It is a gorgeous day, an amazing venue. In addition to hockey, we have all kinds of amazing exhibits. The event just keeps getting better. I, I really and truly believe this. It just keeps getting better. All of us are beyond excited because we're doing such great work here raising money for one of the top five cancer centers. But we also have a great shot at setting two, not just one, two Guinness World Records. The Princess Margaret Cancer Foundation is attempting the record for the largest one day street hockey championship and the most money raised for a charity by a street hockey championship. It just seems fitting that in Canada we're breaking a world record to conquer cancer through road hockey. Cancer has touched so many people's lives. Uh, ball hockey and hockey is a part of our fabric here in Canada, so you put the two of them together, you have a little bit of fun. So it's a it's a win-win for everybody today. When I was 15 years old, I uh, was a minor major hockey player, and first game of the season I broke my leg, and, and months later I was diagnosed with, with spindle cell sarcoma. I did nine months of chemotherapy, and have my leg amputated above the knee. So, you know, this event for me is, is just a way to, you know, hopefully prevent that from happening to, to many other people. My team was formed just over five years ago, first to honor my daughter, uh, who unfortunately then passed away from leukemia. That's the whole reason we play, is to honor her and hope to raise money for research that can help others. 40% of Canadians will be diagnosed with cancer in their lifetime, 40%. And within the next 15 years, there will be a 40% increase in the number of cancer cases in Canada. Now those are frightening statistics, but you're here supporting an organization that is out to change those statistics. Anytime you have the opportunity to give back through the game you love, um, you know, I lost both of my parents to cancer when I was in my 20s. And uh, this is a mission for me, um, you know, I believe in the doctors and researchers and clinicians at the Princess Margaret, if we're going to conquer cancer, it's going to happen there. Last year we were ranked second in the world in our research performance. Road hockey to conquer cancer is the fuel in the tank of that kind of research performance. Everybody here today is playing a big part in raising money to someday help cure this disease that somehow touches everybody one way or another. You have collectively raised over $2.4 million. You're irreplaceable in what will be the victory to defeat cancer in our lifetime. And tell all your friends, game on cancer! When you do something for others, that's when you'll be remembered. And that's exactly what I see in front of me. So well done.